Hey guys, it's Joel. So, today I got one for you that isn't necessarily a scam, it's just a site you should avoid. Welcome to Unio Change. So, this is a pretty basic exchange. Um, as you can see here, it has not a whole lot of bells and whistles or fancy graphics or anything like that. But they do post reviews right here on their main page. And these are all positive. Best way. Uh, okay, I can't read Arabic. But all of these are positive. Every single one. And this is a bit odd, but the news site is empty. This stuff seems kind of weird, right? And it is. This should set you off. You should think, okay, this is suspicious. But here we have actual reviews. A bunch. So, Scam Advisor has 40 negative. Trust Pilot, 3.5, 188. That's pretty middling. But let's look through the ones that are here. A lot of these. I lost $2,000. They cheat me of 6000 Lost all my money here. This is... Okay, let's see. Not first time. Blah, blah, blah. Could be fake. Let's see here. Free fire. Yeah, only review. Okay. But this was also made in, you know, 2021. This site is five years old. It's baffling. I wouldn't have thought that this was like a 2017 one. If it was a scam, it probably would have gone down by now. But there are a ton of negative reviews. And the ones that are positive look really suspicious. Okay, so as I scroll through the slew of negative reviews here, which, by the way, this is the same one as on the front page of Scam Advisor, this one here but made by a different guy. Uh, make of that what you will. But as I scroll through here, I'm just gonna give an opinion on something. There was one dispute that these guys had publicly where the guy had deposited without posting a memo on the deposit. And that was the problem. Now I've seen those sites before where you have to have a, me a memo where the deposit will fail and it's dumb but you know it's part of it anyways here look at this one five star review shit all over him in the comment this is like a who are these podcast reference or something anyways um a lot of the people were complaining that customer service was like a big problem here and yeah if that's going to be an issue, then I suggest that you don't use them. Like, don't use Kraken. Kraken has garbage customer support. So, Binance and uh, Coinbase have good ones. Use them. But if you do something, you mess up, then they won't do anything to help you, it seems like. So, I don't know. But with this number of negative reviews here, just... I guess listen to these people. Use a different site. This isn't good for you. Alright, well, that was it. Not so much a scam busting, but a stay the fuck away. So, I don't know if this is going to have helped anyone, but if you're looking for a review on this site and you see my video pop up, then, I, I don't know, let me know. Just go somewhere else. Don't, don't drop your money here. Anyways, stay safe, do your own research.